Uh, so this is the demo of our infant hydration monitor project. Um, this is a baby leg warmer. For the purposes of this demo, we'll be um, connecting these two leads to um, simulated resistances. Um, but for the real thing, uh, we connect them to the baby's body with this gel electrode. Um, now, so our device works with impedance. Uh, so based on impedance change at 50 kilo, kilohertz uh, range, we predict hydration change. Uh, let me show you some of the device components. If you open up this enclosure here, we have the device. Uh, the device has uh, an RF Duino chip over here uh, to compute the values, communicate with the impedance analyzer chip, and send the values to our, our phone. This is the impedance analyzer chip. Uh, there are some analog front-end components. On the back, we have a battery and a battery regulator over here. So let me turn this on. Let me connect a simulated uh, impedance value. So this is a, an initial impedance value that we um, base our percent changes to. I'll, con I'll turn on this device. So the device then do um, 20 times, 20 times of measurement to find the um, reference point. And right now we have an Android app to display the result. First app we have a connect page which checks the um, connectivity of Bluetooth on the phone. Once it's turned on, we can click scan, which will find the Bluetooth low energy device um, in a proximity area. We just click, click connect to connect to our device. And then we go to data, which shows the initial volume, uh, the percent change of the initial volume since the first time you take the um, measurement. So right now, here it shows 0% change because we haven't changed the um, resistance yet. So right now, we're going to change it. The resistance, resistor to um, 1600 ohm. So we should be expect, expecting a 60% 60, 60 change. So now, right now, we're seeing about 50%. 52%. Oh, we have 64% change, which is about right. We, on the third tab, we also have a graph which shows your uh, a graphical view of a percent percent change over time.